Right guys, so we are back on the golf course. Yay! Yay! <laughs> uh, all children done, everything's uh, everything's flying and we're back on the course. So we're at uh, Rudding Park Golf Club today. I'm trying to zoom in on the, on the, park, on the sign. Uh, Rudding Park Golf Club is Harrogate. Wait, uh, and we're actually on the short golf course here. This is called Repton Short Course. It's a six hole, lovely, lovely little course. It's only been built for about five years. USGA greens, it's October, it's a bit nippy. Pierre's got his waterproofs on. Sad times, this is <laughs> really sad times. <laughs> Guys, I'm sure you've seen Pete on my channel before. If not, go and check out his uh, channel, go and subscribe. And we're gonna have a little match up around this short course. Um, we're also gonna do a little bit of a a, a laser finder um, comparison as well, only because I've I've just had uh, a new one uh, from Shot Saver, so we're going to test that up against the Bushnell. And every one of these holes are actually designed after a certain course. Now this is Wentworth. I'm not quite sure what's went so Wentworth about it. The only thing for me is a big dip before the green, which is very much like the first at Wentworth, and also the trees here on the side. So. Uh, we had it at 131 yards. I had 132 yards with the so, shot saver. So <laughs> Pete's using shot saver, and I'm using the Bushnell. So we'll see which one, uh, which one is well. Uh, we don't know which which one is more accurate. We don't know. We don't know which one's which. Well, we, with our striking as well, we, we never will know either, will we? Really? <laughs> right then, Pete. So what are you going with? Uh, wedge. Pitching wedge. Uh, tailor made. And you never know with six holes, par three. Wedges, we might get some hole in one action. <laughs> there is a hole in one prize, or not? There is. We Whether we will it. get that, I very much doubt, but. <laughs> well, that's, we tried at Formby for about two hours and we didn't get one. So. Right, see, I wasn't there that day. Oh, sorry, Pete. Right. Uninvited that. Sorry. <laughs> wow. Ouch. I really want to pound you into the ground now. What are we fighting? <laughs> Match play, stroke play? Let's do stroke play. Stroke play. Let's do stroke play. Yeah, the 17th, it's, uh, yeah. I should pop the score up. That's the 17th, just over there with the water around it. Right. It seems right, down not it? Didn't quite catch it, go. Oh, it was right down it as well, just yeah. on the, on the front. What was that? That seemed like a very soft wedge. I just didn't, I didn't quite catch it actually. Right down it though, wasn't it? I was it quite was. happy with the uh, direction on that one. Not bad after a, a two hour drive. <laughs> and some poor coffee. So yeah, it wasn't nice. So I'm going to go 9-9 nine -nine this time. 9-9. Nine -nine. Um, yeah, Starbucks, if you're watching, we stopped off at... Um, Stopped off one of your service station outlets, and I have to say, Costa was much better. Ouch. I just want to say thanks to one of our subscribers who sent us through a Costa gift card as well, Unbelievable. which was fantastically and amazing. Who, who left it at Trafford? Yeah. Sorry about that. So thank you very much for that. Gifts are appreciated, <laughs> especially ones which involve caffeine. So you got a little nine. A little nine. Okay. Good, slightly right. Oh, it's big as well. I didn't catch that at all on the camera. Uh, over the bunker, just to the right. Ah, right. Up and down needed. Right then, so, we are off. So Pete's just uh, just come up a little bit short. It was it was right down the flag. Yeah, bang on line, wasn't it? But was that, was that the shot saver that was out, or a bit of you, Pete? I was gonna say that was probably me. Yeah, I'd say it was you. <laughs> uh, I'm just over the bunker on the right. Uh, so we've we've missed the first green at Wentworth, which is a shame. Very much similar to when we played me and my golf, even though this is a different course of Wentworth. Anyway, uh, so what are you gonna play, little Pete? Little bumper run with me nine. Okay. Greens look good, don't they? The greens look amazing. This is a great little facility to come down here and practice. Right to left. Nice chip. How well are they running? Very nice. Well done, good, put. good chip, sorry. You. Yeah, you've only got a little dink in. <laughs> That's about it. So, I've just come up slightly short there with the chip, but... Well, 
I was going to say it was an easy putt, but I shouldn't have said that really before I hit it. So Rick just over the bunker there, it's come down into a eh, reasonable lie there. Yeah, this is nice again because it's got different types of grass to chip off. It's certainly not any pitch and putt this, is it? No, definitely not. It's a real, uh, real design. It's a, well, it's it's a short course, oh, which yeah. is nice. Yeah, it's not a not a pitch and putt, which is good. Right, so I'm, I'm everything is sloping down for me. This is the completely wrong side to miss it on. I'd probably prefer to be in the bunker if anything. So I'm gonna go 58 degree, try and land it on the front and run it, run it down. So I've got lots of loft. Oh, I needed to go more Just left. Just need to go a bit more left. Run out to a perfect distance. Yeah, I, I had the point, there's a leaf on top of the hill and I've missed it. Missed that leaf, so. Oh, lucky. Hey so this is the uh, life of a YouTuber. Rick is using a camera cap for a ball marker. It's <laughs> <laughs> better than my standard usual T though, to be fair, so. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so this is that big slope I was talking about. Yeah. So I've got to get this up here. So Rick kicked off that slope and it ran down to there, so we know it's going to be a wee bit left to right. I think more than, more than a bit actually. Mm. Go on, this will be a good confidence builder for the round, this. The six holes we're playing. Ooh. It's slick. Fooled you a bit that as well, didn't it? Yeah, aren't they slick? Right, so I've marked mine with my uh, lens cap. <laughs> uh, <laughs> a flat you disc. Spend too much time with your camera. A flat disc that I can use. So Pete's got a little uh, three footer up the hill here. Um, well, I'd, for... say, I'd say it's more four foot, but. Okay. Don't boast. Um, for par. Par at the first at Wentworth. Yeah, solid put, sir. Thank you very much. Woo, 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 woo. <laughs> As the crowd's gone oh, wild. It's a bit twitchy over that one. Well, to be fair, we have not been on the golf course, or not on a video for ages now. Well, when was the last course vlog we did? Uh, game golf. The Marriott? At the Marriott. God, how long ago was that? I think that was the end of August. Uh, no, it couldn't have been. End, near end of July, start of August. No. Yeah. Guys, we're sorry about that. <laughs> I'd baby. <laughs> yeah, Rick's Rick's had one of those baby things which apparently take up loads of time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nice point, mate. How nice are these greens? Really good. Probably should stop banging on about waxing lyrical about them, but they are really good. They are gorgeous. It's not again, it's nice you can play a course in October where the greens haven't been spiked, certainly here in the UK. Right. Uh, second hole, do we know what it is? Uh, oh, I'm not sure before Let's look at them. Out. Let's go find that. Yeah. So I'm using my uh, Bushnell here, the Pro 1600, which is quite an older model, really. Um, I've had this for quite a while. Let's see what this this one says, distance-wise. A hundred yards on the nose. So the. The flag is down there. What what hole is this, Pete? This is Augusta. Augusta. So I'm guessing because of its undulations on the green. Undulations on the green. Deep bunkers in before. Yeah, yeah. And big, big kind of tees as well, which is good. So, shot saver. The SLR 500. So much smaller than my version, but like I said, mine is older. Um, so let's see what this has got. So what did you get? I'll let you. Let you do yours first. <laughs> 99. 99. What'd you get? 100. Ah, okay. So we don't know. There's been a yard in it, both holes, but not, not too much of a distance. Right. Um, it's your honour, sir. My honour, right, okay. Level par. Sorry. What are you hitting, Pete? Uh, a little gappy. New gappy? New gappy, yeah. Got the new Cleveland wedges in the bag. Nice, 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 nice. RTX got a lot of. I think mine's the. It's the only one of the ones I've got so far. The only loft I've managed to to actually get into the bag just at the moment. They are coming, so I've got 50 degree as well. I'm not. Um, 
not actually had any proper balls with these. These are the first proper shots we've kind of hit with them. So we've got 99. Uh, August. Come on. I've had a birdie at Augusta before. <laughs> It's on it again. Oh. oh, hello. New wedges. Hello. Hello. Good shot, sir. Thank you very much. Nice. That was really nice. <laughs> that seemed like a very easy swing, that. Yeah, I'm actually... Me and, uh, me and Rick have started our winter workout schedule and I'm feeling pretty stiff, but... I'm feeling pretty up for it. Rick's feeling pretty stiff. I've only done one session. And literally <laughs> cried all the way here. <laughs> <laughs> Stick it in. Uh, nice. Just drifting slightly left. Big. Big again. Yeah. I, I don't know what you were doing in the gym, one but it obviously wasn't as much as me. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the entrance into the second green, uh, guarded by a couple of bunkers either side. That's all um, Yeah, very august, nice and deep bunkers, and then a super undulating green. Uh, just as we walk up, I think I've just about stayed on the back for maybe using putter, and um, Pete stuck it in really close. Really the, close. Uh, rhododendrons at the back. Ah, nice. yes, of course, the roadies. I don't know if you can, yeah, you can see them on camera. So that's why it's uh, a little bit Augusta-esque. So I'm just on the fringe there. I'm going to be putting. See if I can uh, keep up with the big man. So these roadies at the back look beautiful in the spring. Might have to come back here, mate, when the when the weather warms up again. Yeah. When we're out of the long, dark winter. <laughs> so Rick's at the back of the green here. We've got a kind of a hump to go over here. This is why we couldn't actually see it from the tee. So it's quite a big elevation. Can't quite see on the camera and then down. Got a bit of GoPro action on the hole as well. Yeah. Let's see how close we get. It's got a chance. Got oh. a chance. <laughs> he had a look in. A little bit nervous on that one then. So Pete huh. got the uh I tell you what, you can you can always tell when you get new wedges, can't you? Bit of spin. Has it ripped your ball a bit? Well, that was in the first hole. Let me just focus on that one sec. That was the first Oof. hole, and then that, I think, was that hole. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> new wedge time. New wedge time. <laughs> Happy new wedge day. Um, right, so he's given himself a great birdie chance here at Augusta. Come on, Pete. I mean, a par at Augusta would be fine. Yeah, I was happy with the par at Wentworth. <laughs> they, they were in rare supply last time we played. <laughs> Much in this? Um, tiny bit left to right, I think. Ah! Shame. GoPro'd it. GoPro'd it. I was going for a backboard. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, you can have that. <laughs> Just a little too far. I got too excited. I've never played at Augusta before. It's a nice roll. The adrenaline. The adrenaline got the better of me. Very nice roll. Right, well, I've got a not simple par. Clawed in. Steady par. Yeah. Uh, third hole, do we know what this is? Uh, no. We're going to do this in two parts. We're going to do three holes and three holes, so uh, we'll see what the third hole has to offer. You can see it whispering to us through the trees what there. What gorgeous golf course can we be at next? <laughs> so we're on the third hole here, and by the way of a magic mystery tour, we've been transported to Summingdale. <laughs> <laughs> so it's only a shorty. How far we got here? 58. 58. According to Bushnell and Shot Saver. What's the Shot Saver got us at? Fifty-nine. There's Fifty-nine. A yard There's always a yard in it. There's always a yard in it. 
So if I finish Sorry. a yard long or a yard short, we know why. Yeah. Tell you what, you were a yard short in your last one. I was, God. Fucking short saver. <laughs> Um, it's your honour, Pete. I better grab the camera. Oh, sorry. Uh, d you don't apologise for being level pass, sir. Sorry. You don't apologise. I should be apologising for being one over. <laughs> I'm actually pretty proud of myself. I mean, tuning level par at Wentworth in Augusta. You can put this on your CV. If I can manage to go one under a Sunningdale, I'll be delighted. <laughs> so I'll come on this angle so we can really get into the looks of the hole. We should, if we can pop this close, Pete, we can get some good footage on this. Okay. <laughs> yeah. If, if being the word there. What are you going with? Uh, Sandy. I always think this is a bit of a tricky yard, is 58 yards. Mm. Any tips? Um, You're going to give us tips after you've hit it. <laughs> try, and, try and pick a swing, a club and a shot that you know goes 58 yards. <laughs> Words of... Wisdom there, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Words of wisdom. And you know, I'll try and give you a bit of advice on my shot. If I knew what that was for me, I'd be delighted. But <laughs> as I don't, I'm just going to eat some kind of a sandwich down there. <laughs> Little half a sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Oh, just just hopped it over the top. Great strike, yeah. It was. Wedges are really feeling great, actually. So, 58 that was one. Uh, sorry, 58 yards. Yeah, 58. I used a... It's pretty much just over half a swing with the sandwich. Just a little bit too much. Again, great strike, though. So, I'm going to... I'm going to purpose to bring it back a yard or so, because 60 yards, I, I, know my, I know my shot for 60 yards. All right. He says, confidently. <laughs> so I've got my 58 degree. My bit of advice, hopefully slightly better, <laughs> more words of it, <laughs> is try and make a symmetrical swing on both sides. So if you go back halfway, go through halfway. Okay. And that's the shot I'm going for. Okay. He says, confidently. So this is why I was all jokey, because, you know, if I, if, if, if I knew I didn't hit the shot I wanted to, I could be like, oh, you know, so I was having a laugh. But we've got Rick with the symmetrical swings. <laughs> <laughs> that just pop over the back to the right. Yeah. Oh. Wow. To be fair, mate, I think your swings were the same length back and through. Just the <laughs> club face was in the wrong direction when you hit it. <laughs> I think the distance was good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wowza. Right, so up to the green, 58 yards ago, which I think we've both missed. <laughs> it is sunning there, though. It's a tough course. Very tough. It's a tough course. So we are up, well, we're up and around the green <laughs> here at sunning there. Not exactly on the green. Rick's just got off just onto the, the fringe. I'm just on the fringe over there. So. We know which bit of our game we need to work on, Pete. Yeah, this is, well, this is the curse of being a driving range coach, really. Not the greatest touch around the greens no. once we get out of here, no. unfortunately. But that's why we're here. Absolutely. And we've got three more holes to get Three better. more holes to get better. So, so little, nine bump. little bump and run. That's good. Check, check, check. Whoa, 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 whoa. Quick as well again. So Pete, you chipping or putting from there? I'll give it a putt, I think. That's the wise choice. You got a nice line, you're not in the longer stuff. Again, bits of advice if you're uh, if you ever got an opportunity you can get the putter out, get it out. Yeah, just off here. You, there's nothing in between. Well you wouldn't want to there's no point in massively chipping this, getting any height on this shot. No, no, not at all. I don't want to embarrass myself on camera as well, so. Well let, leave me to that bit. <laughs> bit too, a bit too late for both of us really. <laughs> so I think uphill a little bit left to right. And then, yeah. I think it's what's a triple breaker, I think. Ooh, right. Good for it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Speedy, speedy. I'm, I'm, I can't believe how quick they are. 
considering it's October, that's <laughs> rapid. That's really fast. Right, so uh, me and Pete have got two, not gimmies. Not gimmies, no. Well, we could do if we were being friends. If we were playing match plays with each other, yeah. And we weren't recording it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Straight off here with gimme. So, um, kind of a six, six and a half footer. Yeah. About the way you've come from. It did look like it had a great deal of movement coming past the hole, so. Maybe left centre, but. Yeah. I'm pretty confident about this one, actually, to be fair. In spite of myself. Yeah, <laughs> good put. Yeah, yeah. You had the you had the read of that straight away. Good put, sir. Well done. Yeah, it's good. It's nice. It's nice to play on. Nice to play on greens that you're confident about what it's going to do with the roll. So, considering you're only five years old, is that all? It is five years. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, if you if you've well had a look at the hole so far, you'll know they're in within the trees. Oh. Yeah, tidy. In the edge. In the edge. <laughs> <laughs> Two pars, so I'm still one. You're level. Yeah. We've got three holes left to play. Three, and the, the, the big, the bad grass, boys the coming up as well. Grass. The guys, make sure you check out part two. So we're going to jump part two up here. Bang. Check out Pete up here. Bang. Oh, he's behind the camera, but up there. Subscribe to my channel down here. Bang. And we'll see you in part two. Part two. Ha, ha, ha.